Welcome to the Our League Try of the Week, where I, Jamie Jones Buchanan, bring you some of the finest tries from League One, Championship and Super League. Yes, Super League competition. In fact, we're going to go to Wool KR for try number one, where captain Joel Tompkins gives us a Rugby League masterclass. Between Atkin and the try line, we have a hit and spin, dummy offload, right foot step, left arm handoff, Ellie Ramley style crab, turns his brother inside out and then a one-handed foot down to finish off. Rugby League Masterclass 101 in about 12 seconds. Let me watch it again with admiration. The awareness of a Jedi Knight this kid has. Speaking of Jedis, we're in League One for try number two where Jimmy Meadows uses the force to pick up this offensive kick and finds loose forward Dan Einmarsh. And you can't blame the big man for looking like he wants to get rid of the ball having just defended his own line, but he does more than enough to reach the halfway when he picks up Joe Brown who races in to finish off. It wouldn't be a try of the week without a Toulouse Olympique effort and this is why. Where most teams would just take a settler off the kickoff, Ford sees an instant opportunity down the short side. A half break and an offload later, the ball finds the hands of Tony Morrell, who can only have had nitrous oxide in his water bottle to show pace like this. We'll finish at the KC Stadium where a loose pass, the most dangerous of all scenarios, finds magician Tom Johnson, who pokes through and finds Rhys Lynn, who bursts open the defence of his former club before tipping onto Hampshire, who shows pace that even Jamie Shaw can't claw back. A round of applause from the forward pack, I suspect, in appreciation of their bat line. I reckon that Joel Tompkins gives us the Rugby League coaching manual in about 20 seconds right there. He's my favourite, but what do I know? It's your opinion that counts. Cast your votes right here on the Hourly Gap for a chance to win two tickets to this year's Challenge Cup final and a winner will be chosen this Friday.